Last night, we told you Grand Rapids police responded to a video circulating online. It's GRPD body cam video depicting the use of force following a traffic stop. Police Chief Eric Payne has said his officers did the right thing. But others are questioning the use of force shown in that video. Today, 13 on your side's Elena Holland spoke with the attorney representing the driver in that incident. Body camera video of the incident on March 26 shows a Grand Rapids police officer punching a man several times. Now his attorney tells us the driver was pulled over initially because his passenger was seen littering. Now we do want to warn you this video may be disturbing to some viewers. In the video taken at a traffic stop on Hall Street near Division, officers are seen handcuffing the passenger of the vehicle who stepped out of the car. Then they ask the driver, whose attorney identified him as Diabate Hood, to step out as well. What did I have to step out the car for? Sir, just get out, man. It, you could be walking away from this. You get out of that car. Shortly after, Hood tries to go out the open passenger side door. Officers are seen pulling him out of the vehicle. When he is on the ground, an officer punches Hood several times. I didn't do nothing. Oh, 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 stop resisting. Stop resisting. His attorney said in that moment, Hood tried to go out the door because he was scared. Because they've seen this all too often, where it's a it's a um, traffic citation that escalates, and before you know it. As a young black man laid in the middle of the street, shot to death. Attorney Tyrone Bynum says his client was not resisting. The video continues showing officers checking his pockets and claiming Hood tried to pull a gun on them. That's as Hood complains about his eye. Look at my eye! Yeah. You're lucky you're not dead, so how about you just stop? You're lucky you're not dead. What do you mean? Was it your intent to kill him? And he's lucky that he messed up your plan? Third gun. Later in the video, officers say they found multiple guns. Wednesday, Grand Rapids police said the driver was attempting to disarm an officer and the use of force was deemed necessary to stop the threat and affect the arrest. Chief Eric Payne said in a statement, this is the police work I expect from my personnel. I made the enforcement of violent crime and the recovery of illegal firearms one of the department's top priorities. The traffic stop was done during GRPD's recent Operation Safe Neighborhood, surveilling areas where related to increased violent crime. But Bynum called the incident racial profiling and excessive force. Is a black man who is the chief of police says that he is proud of the way these guys handled themselves. I can't believe that he would be so out of touch with his own people. Bynum said his client is charged with three felonies, resisting to disarm a police officer, felony firearm, and resisting and obstructing. In Grand Rapids, Elena Holland, 13 on your side.